preparation of amines from aldehydes and ketones by reductive amination very very interesting reaction i have considered here carbonyl group of aldehyde and ketone because the remaining molecule is not important here you focus only on carbonyl group whether it is aldehyde or ketone you have to focus on carbonyl group listen carefully so when you are using ammonia for this synthesis you have to take two hydrogens from this ammonia and join with this oxygen this is condensation reaction where water molecule is removed and this nh is joining or taking the position of this oxygen so this compound is called imine which we cannot isolate this imine is now subjected to reduction by using very very interesting reducing agent this is called sodium cyanoborohydride this sodium cyanoborohydride is used more efficiently for this reduction now reduction means addition of hydrogen and these hydrogens are coming from this sodium cyanoborohydride this h now you have to join one h you are here and one h over nitrogen c which i have shown by using red color so to remove this double bond you have to add one h on this carbon which was a carbonyl carbon and one h on the nitrogen so when you are using ammonia and aldehyde or ketone we get here primary amine so this is primary amine because of nh2 group what will happen if we are using instead of ammonia if you are using primary amine or nh2 is primary amine because you can use it here two hydrogens are taken from this primary amine and water is liberated water is liberated and we get this compound this compound is produced now this is uh, uh, this is treated with sodium cyanoborohydride again one hydrogen is joined here and another hydrogen is joined over nitrogen which i have shown by using a red color I remove that double bond so this is converted to the secondary amine so aldehyde and ketone can be converted to the secondary amine when we use primary amine for the reductive amination when we use secondary amine for reductive amination we get ammonium uh, iminium ion iminium ion is produced double bond and positive charge iminium ion is produced you can see here so <coughs> when this is <coughs> forming bond this carbonyl carbon we get oh and then oh is removed to form iminium ion again subjected to reduction by using sodium cyanoborohydride here only one hydrogen is added over this carbonyl carbon which was carbonyl carbon and we get here tertiary amine so you can see the importance of this reaction by using aldehyde and ketone you can prepare primary amine secondary amine tertiary amine by using same kind of reduction reducing agent and almost similar kind of reaction we are performing here i have taken one example you can see here whatever structure is given whatever complicated structure is given you focus only on carbonyl group so i focus only on carbonyl group and when i use here ammonia i have to remove water molecule by taking two oh from this nh3 and form imine this imine is subjected to sodium Uh, subjected to reduction by using sodium cyanoborohydride one h is added over nitrogen and one h is added over carbon remove that double bond so i got here primary amine so in this way you can produce primary amine secondary amine tertiary amine by using a uh, reductive amination of aldehydes and ketones